the batteries. see the 90 percent is occupied the floor with the grass but 2,000 years ago you still see remains of some white spot that's a marble it was very elegant rectangular shape the building down there on my left with the long stairs and dark pillars was a temple dedicated to Jupiter he was the main god the building was the government and this area the market areas so you can see religious commercial and political area now in a minute you're going to have a little free time so it's up to you to stay here in the shade and relax or just to go around to cross the square and to go all the way down there but I tell you it really worth to go and you can already recognize from here a lot of wooden shelves and on those wooden shelves you have a lot of those wine jars amphora made of terracotta like this kind of bricks for olive oil water wine etc then you will see remains of a marble some statues the very last the section on the right you will see a big uh, bronze jewelry box but now it's empty <laughs> all the jewelries are in Naples Museum like so many bronze statues which were in the square and there finally you're gonna see the famous plaster cast of the bodies all right remember I told you the body's gone decomposed so you will see the second section the first one then the third one you will see a glass box it's a transparent of course and inside you see a plaster cast of a dog then you will see another one. It's a man, according to archaeologists. This plaster cast a man with the hands close to its mouth. And its position seems that it was sitting somewhere. But you must imagine this position on the floor, lying down. That's a typical, you know, fetal position. And then you will see a big glass box. Inside was a lady. She's lying down with the arm like this always trying to be protected from the gas. And when you look at that lady with the arm like this, check the sides of her stomach, a little bit bigger. It means that she was pregnant. Here you have only four or five of this plaster cast. But imagine, in a couple hundred years, we made a hundreds of this. Now, from here you can see the other side of the square with the wonderful marble colonnade. Used to be all along that areas. 
and behind the column, first level, it was like the ceiling, like an arcade, with the longer balconies are facing into the beautiful square. Something really nice. The volcano is that direction, but unfortunately, this morning, we don't see nothing because of haze everywhere, but volcano is about four and a half miles from here. Now, I suggest you, if you want, you can follow me the other side, okay? Are you all coming with me? Very nice. Let's go. I like her and I like the lady in Paris too. Yeah. So and you at least see that corner in the shade where the arch is? That will be the meeting point, let's say quarter two, all right? So you can go around, go and see the bodies, and then quarter two, I meet everybody there by this big arch. That's the way to go. So you have, there's a little free time. So this way you don't have to rush. Come on, this is that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna check that out first and then walk my way back. Are you so filming? Are you gonna like make a website for this? Or put it on a DVD? Oh, that's a good question. I think she she couldn't come because she was getting stuff ready. I think. Because she was what? Getting stuff ready. I think. Oh, maybe. Oh, that's for sure, so. Oh. Is it, are you going to put, like, all the time DVD? Um, I may. And if not, I'll pop in most of the videos on YouTube. <laughs> like the one at the airport in Germany? Yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You mean like the funny ones? No, just about all of them. That'll probably be the easiest way for folks to get them. <laughs> 